Hello and welcome to this episode of How to Run on Zwift in which we introduce the brand new way to update the firmware on your Zwift Run Pod. You no longer need to use the third party milestone app to update your firmware. You will be prompted in game right within the Zwift app. So let's look at how to do it. All you do is you go into your Zwift app, load it up on your PC or your Mac or your iPhone, your Android phone even, or Apple TV even. And all you do is you go into the run screen, the pairing screen, and you see here I've got my run pod there. All I do is select that as the speed source, and then I click OK. And once I've clicked OK, we'll go into the run screen, Click run. And here we are with the RunPod firmware update notice. So we can click update RunPod. It says estimated time is three minutes and we're currently upgrading to version 4.0.52 as of May 2019. So click update and it says update in progress. So let's see if this works. I did have to try this a couple of times to get it to work. So initially I paired the Zwift pod and then I went into the normal run screen and the update didn't appear. So I went back to the pairing screen, unpaired the Zwift pod, paired it again and this time the firmware update has appeared. Make sure you keep your run pod close to your device so the Bluetooth connection is not interrupted. And obviously it stands to reason that you shouldn't close the Zwift app. And here we are just getting to the end. So let's see what happens now. And there we are, the RunPod firmware update is complete. 4.0.52 is now on our footpod. So we'll click close, back, and we're ready to run. I did try this with the Milestone foot pod, that's the old foot pod with the M on the front instead of the Z or the Z. If you have one of those foot pods, I can't guarantee that the firmware update will come to your foot pod. It may well be that Zwift have stopped supporting the Milestone foot pod. However, if you have got a Zwift pod, load up the Zwift game, pair up your Zwift pod, and hopefully you should get a firmware update right there within the game. Thanks very much for watching, that's it, take care, bye bye.